E hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. We are going into 5-3 of Yogurt Yard and it appears to be a spooky volcanic area and wait, 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 I could use that high jump. I definitely could use that high jump here. Yeah, feel the power of the jump button. Well, it's actually the B button, which isn't normally the jump button, but it works as the jump button here. And there's some humping pigs in the wall. They've evidently been locked away for being sexual predators or something like that. At least that's what it seems like. I don't think this... Ah, high jump will be of use to me here. I bet you the wheel of power is something that I'll need, though. So let's go take a walksy around here, or a rollsy, one of the two, and hit our face right in the wall twice in a row. And... Ah! No, 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 no. Uh, uh, luckily for... I mean, luck, luckily I have good reaction time. And... Is there anything of... Whoa, no, 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 I don't think so. I don't, wait, wait, wait. Is there anything... Aha! I seen that. Did you see that? Two blocks in a row like that? I mean, two vertical blocks in a row? That usually in the, in the case there's a hidden door. Well, not usually, but... It's a good thing with... I should say it's a good thing to bet with a Kirby game that there's gonna be a secret. Uh, Kirby games are just like that. So always, always when you see two blocks in a row like that, uh, oh, what the heck? How, how the heck did I even take a hit there? I, I use the rock power, but anyway, as long as you have, uh, I, I kind of, uh, I hit my head on there, but somehow I didn't take a hit, but whatever. Uh, as the, anyway, as I, I was saying, Kirby is a very secret, secretive game, has a lot of secrets, and they're sometimes very cheaply hidden. <laughs> That's all I can say about that. And next one, 5-4 of Yogurt Yard. Let's start. Whoa, 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 wait. Oh, there isn't anything this time. Okay. Just wanted to be sure. I need burning power, though, for some stuff. For some stuff. And whoa, no, no. Oh, poopers. I definitely could use that burning power, because if I'm not mistaken, there's going to be a one-up, like, through that little new, normally inaccessible area down there. Oh, yeah, there's another one. Uh, okay, so I should just be able to whoop, and then whoop, there we go. And, oh, no, 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 oh, that was a trap. Crap, it's a trap. Ah! Anyway, oh, these guys, these guys, really, they keep trying and they keep failing. Oh, it's kind of sad, actually. And these guys aren't really that hard at all. They just kind of walk around, and that's kind of predictable. So, wait, 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 more? Wait, this actually looks like there's a bunch more, according to that boss bar there. And, no, uh, that's it. Well, okay, whatever. So that's the end of that, and there's a bouncy ball guy. Is he something... Let me up the ladder. Jesus. Oh, no, I lost the bouncy ball guy. Um, they probably want me to use the bouncy ball guy here because of all these low enemies. You know, so you can bounce right on their head. But I think I'm going to just... You know, play it safe and just fly over them. That seems like... Oh, oh, I knocked away my own power. Wait, 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 wait. I bet you this is a secret. I bet you it's a secret. Yeah! Um, oh, I'll go on this one. Breath of Wind going up. Yay! Boss Arena! And... Back out the door we go. And up here for a maximum tomato for the win. Um, through, wait... Oh, I could've got that one up by sucking at it, but oh well. Yeah, literally sucking at it. Oh my god, there's pigs humping walls everywhere. It's an orgy of fun. Ah! And well, that's the end of the stage, I guess. I guess they, we had to end the stage on a high note of uh, non-kid-friendly fun there. Woo! 5-5 five five coming up next after this boss arena thingy here. Let's do this. It's bonkers. You give me a star. Thank you. Ah, oh, I just threw it right underneath you. Give me a coconut in place of that. And there we go. Come on, I can take you on. I can take you on. Come on, swing your hammer. There you go. do si do For the show in front of the crowd. And give me a coconut. There we go. You're done. Give me your hammer. Yeah. Filthy ape! Anyway, here we go <laughs> to a 5-5, and there appears to be some seemingly odd-growing... Oh shoot, I just lost that. I don't want to go near, near the cannon. Some uh, odd-growing branches, like, floating in the trees. Uh, or at least it seems odd to us. Perhaps it is natural in the Kirby world. Is there... Oh, there is something down here. I was, I was gonna check back here, and then I was gonna, like... Uh, but then I decided to go up further and then drop down here, but whatever. Um... Uh, 
Um, what? How does this work? Um... Oh, I get it, I get it. Watch us. Grab him, and quickly light the fuse, lose your power, grab him, high jump, through the blocks, into the cannon, press down. Yeah! <laughs> I don't know how I figured that out so quick. Anyway, that unlocks that, and through the door. I guess I'm just used to Kirby powers or something like that. I should say that the trickery of Kirby. And that's probably the only secret of this level. There's, I believe there's only one secret per stage. Uh, or if, if a stage has a secret, there's only one of them, I should say. Avoid the parasol, waddle these. Oh my god, no, not the umbrella! The umbrellas are the most dangerous of all floating instruments. Even, they, even though they don't kind of float, they'll seem to be like possessed umbrellas or something like that. Perhaps I'm gonna have to get an exorcism on those umbrellas. So, the warp star takes us to this castle area. Medieval castle, may I add, and... Sword or fire? I'm gonna get the sword. Because I like the sword. I'm biased towards the sword. And... Here we go! I bet you there's a boss. Yeah, I thought so. And I think, actually, the, ugh, the fire would have been a little bit better, because you have some range against this. Um... The, the main power of this guy, well not power, uh, it, the main problem with this guy is his speed and unpredictability. Uh, as you can see, when you're close up to him, he uh, uh, he can either do a swipe attack or just jump at you or even do a, like a flame attack like this thing. Uh, he gives you the burning power once you beat him. I'm just taking that because I might need it, I don't know. Um, yeah, oh, wait, wait, laser? Laser? Oh, I could've used the laser here. I could see that because of the curved grounds, or I should say the angled ground. Oh, well, oh, oh, I can use you! Aha! Yeah! Uh, oh, the stage is already over, dang it. And that's it! Woo! Yeah, I got a little ahead of myself there with the singing, so I just cut myself off right there. Um... This is the stage that I remember that requires the hammer power. Um, I'm going to show you where it is on my first run, and then like cut cut forward to me uh, getting the hammer. Well, not getting the hammer power. Um, because I don't I don't really feel like getting the hammer power and then going through the stage because it's it's kind of luck based in the fact that you have to get through it. Look off these guys. Just run past them if you can. Um, because of the fact that when you get the hammer power, you pretty much can't take a hit, otherwise you'll lose your hammer power. Uh, you can recover it like in the first area, but the second- ah, Second is unlikely. And there is this ambush Waddle D coming out of nowhere there, and I'm gonna suck you in this time. Yeah! Because I knew you were there. And you guys are going down, and in this upcoming door here, this is where you need the hammer. Yeah, you can't break these steel blocks with anything else but a hammer. So, you, your only choice is to come back here later once you have that. So, what I'm going to be doing here is getting that maximum tomato and leaving this area. And then going to another stage um, that wasn't at 5-2 to get a hammer. And then I'll be going back to that area and hopefully succeeding. Alright, I got the hammer power, so what I'm going to be doing is pausing, then click leave through a door, which will let me ex exit the stage with my power. So, now I'm going to go back to 5-6 and show you exactly why this is extremely annoying. Okay, first you got this area with the wheels. This is not, in the least, a very hammer-friendly area. I'm going to tell you that right now. Um, because your hammer is a lot slower than these wheel guys, so, ooh, maximum tomato, I could use that. But it, you're unlikely to lose your hammer in this area, it's just the fact that, um, oh shoot, yeah, you take hits like that. Um, but you have to get your hammer all the way, all the way over to that door on the other side, you know, of this level. So, let's just go and show you what I mean by that. And don't even bother trying to get ahead of these guys this time. Just hammer your way through as you go. Um, shoot, I want to... Yeah, there we go. I'd rather run across these gaps than uh, jump on, jump across them. It's just a lot safer, in my opinion. 
and hopefully I'll be able to make it without getting ambushed by a Waddle Dee. Come on, there you go. Where's not? There's the other one. Come on. I guess this wasn't that bad because I'm just like right here now. And there's the door. And get inside the door. Here we go. There is the secret, and I believe it's there. We go. It's right there. The door is there, and there's the switch that unlocks that. I am. That's it for this, and if you want, you can, once you beat a stage, and you have to go back to get a secret, here's a little trick, just pause it, leave through a door, and your secret will be saved. Um, I should say your secret collecting thing will be saved when you press the switch. Anyway, it's boss time, it's Heavy Mole! Just, uh, if you don't have a power, you have to suck in his missiles and throw them back at him. If I were you, I would not... Yeah, those missiles. Do not absorb their powers. Like, some some bosses give you powers if you suck in their enemies that they shoot out at you. Oh, shoot. Do not suck in those missiles. They will give you the sleep power, which will more than likely kill you because you'll probably get squished by the screen. And that's the end of Heavy Mole. That is a pretty nice background, I have to say. Alright. Level 6. The orange ocean. Oh my god, it's a shark! Oh! Run, Kirby, run! Okay, in this one, I believe you also need the hammer. So, as long as I've got it, let's just hope for the best that I don't lose it. As you can see, it starts off in water. That is not good for the hammer power-up, because if I take a hit anywhere here, I will lose that hammer. Um, do not... Do not fight... Oh, shoot. No, 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 I don't think so. If, do, do not go in here and fight the boss. It's an elephant boss, and it's an extremely tough one, because there's a little thin, thin one square block of water, and it's extremely hard to fight that boss in there. I highly do not recommend fighting that boss. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. I don't want to lose it. I don't lose it. Ah. Uh, well, there's a one up here. I'm, I successfully got this far with the hammer. All right. Take it easy. Do not lose the hammer. Let him fall off. Off the, let him fall off the earth there. And there we go. Okay, things are okay for now. Please don't get ambushed. Oh my god, he's gonna ambush me. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Oh, holy cow. I could lose my power right down that gap. Is this, I think this is where I need the hammer. Yes, it is. So hammer that and go inside here. There is your switch. That wasn't that bad, actually. I did both hammer ones in a row. That's really surprising. Anyway, now I can lose the hammer all I want. Yes! Yes! I can go through stages recklessly again. Yay! That makes me happy. And now I can... Oh, shoot. Leave this area and end this part because I think I'll only have enough time to finish a stage. And that'll be it. So... Uh, oh, shoot. I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead. Oh, there's the exit. Must get... Exit. Must kill birdie. Oh, shoot! Fish! No! Yeah, give him the sword guy! Yeah! See you the end of the stage. Hope you enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next part.